back to Farming Simulator. Well, not quite. It is a Fact Sheet Friday. It's the first Fact Sheet Friday for the premium expansion, which just to remind you releases on the 14th of November for all platforms. It includes the new map, um, three new crops, so again, carrots, parsnip and red beets, some new productions linked to those and some other new productions, new vehicles and equipment. We're gonna have a look at the first of those today. And if you're interested in picking it up, please use code disturbed when you check out. It doesn't cost you anything and it helps me out a little bit. So let's go have a look at what's coming. So we have got the Dwarf GBC. So this is a pull behind root crop harvester that is going to do the three new crops. So my understanding is that map makers will be able to add the new crops to any map but you will need the dlc to be able to use them so that's really cool um so pull behind harvester always a bit of a pain to use hopefully we'll get some bigger modded ones at some point but you know hundred thousand pounds hundred and one thousand pounds only needs 100 horsepower runs at six miles an hour one row working with so that's going to be pretty painful if you're harvesting big fields that doesn't sound fun hopefully we're going to get something bigger um five and a half thousand liter capacity pretty standard pull behind harvester um it looks really nice we've seen a bunch of pictures of it i think it looks really good i'm a little bit skeptical about single row harvest with hopefully there'll be some bigger equipment as part of the dlc maybe a two row one you know double the speed that it can work at then we've got the unia apollo 16 premium which is a manure spreader um looks like a nice size manure spreader actually probably something that i can see myself using uh, this one is fifty thousand pounds dollars or euros needs 110 horsepower runs at nine miles an hour and it's got 12 meter working with so it's pretty good and twenty thousand liter capacity actually that's really good um definitely can see me using that one and then last but not least we have these two and i am somewhat excited about one of these so first we have the Gorenk puller 450 which is a four and a half meter weeder um, and it needs 45 horsepower seven mile an hour working speed and then we have the fiat 160 90 dt i for some reason i've really grown to love that this kind of era of fiat tractors i'm using them on two saves at the moment um, this one is 92,250 pounds dollars or euros 160 horsepower so nice and you know, a nice kind of starter tractor is quite expensive compared to the other fiats that's generally a problem with how giants price vehicles you know it's an old tractor it should probably have an old price um but that's that's just a personal thing so it's a manual plus power shift gearbox or you just put it in automatic and it'll probably behave if it's set up properly 24 mile an hour or 40k gearbox so not overly fast but it's an older tractor so yeah i'm quite excited about the tractor the manure spreader i would like a wider harvester a four and a half meter weeder it doesn't excite me so much but overall pretty pretty i'm still really looking forward to the premium expansion so quick recap it's coming out on the 14th of november for all platforms feel free to use my partner code if you want and this is what we've seen so far of what's coming plus the map that we've seen already and some of the other sneak peeks of things i'm assuming that we're going to be getting these regularly now in the what is it four weeks four or five weeks running up to the release so looking forward to it Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button. Any thoughts on this uh, these fact sheets, stick it below and I'll see you next time.